Hi, this is Ilma Art Studios photograph for today. A beautiful the train station in Orangeville. They actually do like uh, tourist uh, train trips in the Four Seasons. Hi, check my website at ilmaarts.com for more artworks and photographs. Today, I'd like to share Matthew 15 verse 13. It says, every plant not planted by my Heavenly Father will be uprooted. Here's my poem. The Good Gardener. God the Father is like the good gardener. He plants seeds and ensure they are watered. He sees to it that they get all the nutrients they need. He plants them where they would thrive and breed. When weeds invade the garden of our Heavenly Father, he uproots each of them that wants to take over his garden. He sorts out all those he didn't intend to be there. He cares for all that he planted and watches their progress. Here's my essay. Have you ever gardened or taken care of any plant? If you have, I'm sure you understand how much care is needed for that plant to grow. I always loved trees and meadows and gardens, but where I originally came from, the Philippines, we didn't have much space to mostly have a garden. I lived in the city, so it was very congested. My first boyfriend got me interested in plants and fishes. As early as a young teenager, I have always been caring for houseplants and fishes and aquariums, or sometimes birds. I remember an old friend was amazed how I cared for fishes, birds, and plants. When I moved to Canada, my 20-year-old plants were still alive when I left. God uproots any weeds from his people to ensure his will will transpire. transpire. Prayer. Lord, thank you for nurturing and caring for me. Reflection. What weeds have popped out in your life that needs to be uprooted by God? Well, the weed of bitterness sometimes still comes to me, um, which, is, uh, which has a history of um, traumas in my life. Another weed that comes out is a nagging uh, weed because I think a nagging became uh, um, something that I that I imbibed from my family and sometimes it uh, comes up once in a while in my life but uh, God is always uh, faithful to correct me with that. Another weed in my life could be anger um, or reaction. Uh, each time I don't get my way sometimes I would automatically react from my natural self but um, God always reminds me in his word never to give in to it. Uh, another uh, weed that can come out sometimes is uh, the worry weed, which means that sometimes I could worry over something and um, it, it, it sometimes consumes me. Another is pride, because sometimes pride gets in the way of me hearing what God wants for me to do in my life, or pride sometimes makes me boast about things that are not mine, but the Lord's. So I encourage you, just like God is a good gardener, uh, try to check what weeds have been cropping up in your life so that you will be able to ask the Holy Spirit to help you uproot them, because only God can uproot them. We can't. So uh, let the Holy Spirit uproot those weeds and then you will be able to move through and be able to go through the growth that God wants you to do. Thanks for watching. I hope you check my website at ilmaars.com for more artworks and photographs. Have yourself a wonderful day. God loves you so much and so do I.